Let's understand how can you log into the portal. To log into the portal, I'll just type portal.azure.com. You must have a Microsoft account or an Azure account to log into the Azure. So you'll have to type your user ID and a password to log into to log into the Azure portal. Once you're logged in, you know, this is what the self-service provisional portal is all about. So you can create virtual machines, you can create networks, load balancers, storage, databases, everything that you may want to create. I'm currently logged into my portals. The first way of managing your resources is through this portal. You can also manage the portal or manage the resources in this portal using this little button, Cloud Shell. So when you click on it, it launches this small little box. So if you want to run CLI commands, you can run it right from here. You can either go for a bash or a PowerShell depending on your expertise. So if you have expertise in Linux you could have selected the other one because I am a PowerShell guy so I select po selected PowerShell it will create a storage account for you once the storage account is created you can then create virtual machines right from this CLI or terminal looking console the other ways are using PowerShell and CLI which I'm going to show you using the upcoming chapters